The defense counsel in the trial involving seven soldiers accused of the coup plot against the Barra government has asked the state council to put their house in order for the speed trial of the case. Now, this assertion from the defense council came when the state council, A.M. Yusuf, asked for an adjournment in order to file a bill of indictment and also to give time for the 16th and 17th accused persons to find a lawyer for a speedy trial. Let's have more details of that in this report by Maria Macha. The trial of the eight soldiers who were accused of planning to overthrow the government of the day began at the High Court in Banjul, presided over by Justice Basir V.P. Mahoney. When the case was called, seven of the eight accused persons entered the dock, while one of the accused persons is still at large and was not present. The accused persons include Sana Federa, Alec Ringleader, Gibril Dabo, Ibrahim Asano, Ibrahim Balde, Omar Koli, Babu Kanjai, Bara Turi, and Lamik Jadamo, who is still on the run. The legal team representing the accused persons include lawyer Ellis Kamara, standing in for the first accused person, Sana Fadera, the Alec Ring leader, and the fourth accused person, Ibrahim Balde. Lawyer Yankuba Dabo is representing the second accused person, Jibril Dabo. Lawyer A. Jaju representing Omar Koli, the fifth accused person, and lawyer A. Jabate is representing the third accused person, Ibrahim Sano. However, the sixth accused person, Babu Kanjai, and the seventh accused person, Bara Ture, do not have a lawyer at the moment. Both accused persons said they are in consultation with their families in a bid to have a legal representation. As the proceedings continue, the State Council A.M. Yusuf, considering this is the first time the case is being had at the High Court from the lower court, asked for an adjournment for the State to file a bill of indictment for the case to proceed. However, Ellis Kamara, who is representing both the first and the fourth accused person, told the court that the state should put their house in order because the accused persons have been detained for close to a month now. He argued that the continuous detention of the accused person for almost 30 days without trial is unacceptable. Counsel Ellis Kamara also indicates that the eight accused persons should not be included in the charge seat and he cannot be tried in absentia. Meanwhile, Counsel representing the fifth accused person said that the trial should be sped up Hence, the treason charge is unbailable. Presiding over the case, Justice Mahoney orders the state to file a bill of indictment on or before the 23rd of January 2023. He also ordered that the same indictment should be served to the defense counsel in line with practice directives 1. Justice Mahoney also adjourns the case to the 24th of January 2023 at 1 p.m. On the same alleged coup trial, the three civilians allegedly involved in the alleged coup and charged with concealment of treason and conspiracy to commit a felony, namely Mustafa Jabi, Sekou Jabi, and the police officer sub-inspector Faba Karijawa were also adding in court. Lawyer Ellis Kamara is also representing all three accused persons. Like in the earlier hearing, the state also applied for an adjournment to file indictment bill, with both cases now expected to proceed on January 24th at the High Court in Banjul. The court proceedings were also witnessed by family members of the accused persons who filled the courtroom to show solidarity to their loved ones. Reporting for iAfrican News, I am Mariam Cham.